Yeah, it's it's like, like, uh, it does. Like How this, is it so? This is the last known photo. Of this, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, it's like there's a pruder film or something. You said my hair was okay. <laughs> <laughs> Driving to uh, studio, day two. Nothing. And I am nothing. <laughs> Story of my life. Uh huh? Autobiography. I laid down two tracks already King Prowler and Pleasures of Evil. The rest will be laid down today, which is fantastic. And this is what it looks like from here. <laughs> I turned off the click because it was getting bad. And I'd rather just do another tape. Well, I'm just adding one. It's the same as your beat before, except after that, sn that snare, you put in a kick. That's it. Yeah. That's how I was trying to go. Everybody ready? Oh, yeah. Okay. down the bass at the same time. Uh, give you a, get that good live feel. I just thought it might be cool to have the bass just hang those notes. We also are recording the guitar too. See if that works. Uh, as Bobby does the scratch tracks. I like to hear Bobby sing to play to the parts. Look at that primitive creature. What's that? Look at that creature. Primordial That's so rare. Crawled out of the primordial muck. Look at that. Hello, Mississippi. Gets my pregnant. For me, as the drummer, I play to the guitar and the vocals. Sometimes the bass. Typically, that's what you're supposed to do. You're supposed to play to the bass. But I play to the guitar and the vocals. So how I uh, manifest my drum parts is through, you know, the fucking kick-ass fucking riffs. <laughs> Kind of drum part you want for this and then he goes hmm how about something like this and I'm like okay and then I go sometimes it works sometimes we just you know you have to keep trying and trying again make sure something you know connects even in the studio um, there's a couple times where Bob Hogue was like um can you put like a Feel a little earlier, you know, in this spot right here. Go with the flow, baby. You want to make sure that the the sounds are what you want at the very beginning, so you don't have to worry about it later. Um, so testing the drums for I don't, I don't know how long, but a very long time. Okay, you all ready? Mm -hmm. okay. The guitar tones and the bass tone mix it all mixed together. I feel that last one, the witches one, that's like the ending one, so it's got the fade out. Yeah, I felt the same way actually. I was like, unless they have something that's more ending-ish, that should be the last one. <laughs> Yesterday, when we, when we went to the studio, Hogue was telling us about his, like, this surprise birthday party his, his wife uh, planned for him and all this stuff. 
and I'm like, oh shit, is your fucking birthday? And I'm like, damn, all right, well, gotta get you a birthday again. So. Got him a very sick ass birthday gift. And uh hope you dig good. Whoa, well, thank you guys. I love it. Thanks, buddy. What song is next? Let's see. Okay, uh, I was, uh, pick one. Pick a good one. The devils in hell. All the devils. <laughs> To do, I, I thought it might be a good chance to take a quick lunch break. Yeah, Jim Jones. Jim Jones. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I think I have the biggest car, so. We'll you don't have to brag about it, dude. <laughs> I'm just brought it up. Fucking car, bitch. Take that fucking shit out of it. Mm. Oh, that's good. Fucking car, bitch. Like my large shorts? Yeah, we get it. We get it long. <laughs> <laughs> Twenty twos. <laughs> Sick. That is another building right there. There's almost there's very little space between the Cecil. Mm -hmm. The ho the water tank she was found in is right there, and they've got a sheet covering reporters from seeing the body. Oh, there she is. What's the context in the elevator? Was she freaking out on camera? Oh yeah. Never seen it. No. It's like we can watch it real quick and we'll go. It'll haunt your damn dreams. Uh, That's it. She doesn't come back. So, this is the last known photo. Yeah, it's like there's a Pruder film or something. You said my hair was okay! <laughs> <laughs> Look at it. Looks like I have a wig on. Shit. I don't know, but the caption for this should be this wig, Bobby. Uh, like, it's too big. <laughs> it's coming in. No, here. I thought about that. If I end up adding crazy amounts of keyboards. Oh, I have a plan. Rumor has it, there's probably going to be some sexy fucking keyboards going on. You know, some heavier keyboards. And. I brought some horror movie sound clips to the studio for those old schoolers out there to get those roots, uh, touch those roots. I like them, and uh, I guess if you have the album right now, you'll know if we used them. Where am I? That's right. What year is this? Is this 1955? I can do it. <laughs> it's 2018. But then I. <laughs> Well, then I guess I'd have to go again, wouldn't I? <laughs> well, I'll see ya. Excuse me? Put that away, sir. Thirsty homicidal killer. We tracked the rest of the uh, bass and drums today. The last eight songs on the album, soon to be titled album. Album number seven, that's right. Uh, we tracked Demon Spitter, we tracked Invisible Witches, uh, Gates of Hell, um, End of Time, Hallucinatory Void, uh, amongst other song titles I can't remember right now. 